That's horrible. That's just shocking. It's terrible. Why? Who's doing that? Members of the Jewish community and beyond are horrified by the hate mail that arrived at numerous synagogues across the country yesterday, including this one behind me near Bathurst and the 401. This is a copy of the flyer. It says, Jewry must perish. And it shows a swastika drawn inside a bleeding Star of David. Police are investigating this as a hate crime. The anti-Semitism is real. There's somebody who put the time and effort into this to intimidate and threaten um, and really hopes that you yourself uh, should not exist as a human being. B'nai B'rith now says at least 10 synagogues have been targeted to date, including congregations in Toronto, Montreal, Hamilton, Kingston and Edmonton. But today, the head of the Jewish community organization says that number could continue to rise. Um, B'nai B'rith is coordinating with hate crimes officers all the way across the country. We're working with institutions. If any Jewish institutions or synagogues have not come forward yet, please do. Please coordinate both with B'nai B'rith and your local police. For us to have received this in yesterday's mail is really quite a shock. I think they're being troublemakers. Maybe they hope that it will upset people in the Jewish community yeah. and put them off balance. Uh, mm -hmm. What I think it does however, is that it turns the tables in a more positive way because there are people who reach out and say, not just in the Jewish community, but throughout all communities, yeah. that this is terrible and this is not what we as a country stand for. It makes people stand up and say that this is not who we are about. Rabbi Seed is particularly saddened that this happened during the Jewish holiday of Hanukkah, a time of year that underscores the values that are so important, not just to the Jewish community, but to all Canadians. Others say they are not surprised. It doesn't surprise me to the least. It happens all the time, most of the time. Uh, the media is not interested or doesn't hear about it or nobody cares. So people need to remember that hate is always going to be here and we have to stand up for it. We can't be weak. Right. We've got to be strong. That's yes. the way it is. B'nai B'rith Canada says that across the country in 2016, more than 1,700 acts of anti-Semitism were reported to them through their uh, anti-hate hotline or to police. Tonight, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau tweeting that these acts of hatred and anti-Semitism have no place in our country and they won't be tolerated.